Hey everyone, I'm Toby from the DJI Agriculture team, and in this video we will introduce the Agris T50 and T25 spraying system and how it works. The Agris T50 has a 40 liter spraying tank, and in one flight it can spray 2 hectares of farmland or 0.2 hectares of orchards. The Agris T25 has a 20 liter spraying tank, and in one flight it can spray 2 hectares of farmland or 0.1 hectares of orchards. The spraying system includes multiple sensors, including a level gauge, a dual channel electromagnetic flow meter, and weighing sensors, which can detect in real time how much pesticide or liquid chemical remains in the spraying tank. You can see this information on the DJI Agris app. This helps the drone precisely control flow rate, ensuring spraying accuracy during different flying speeds. The drone's multiple sensors help predict the breakpoint, so ground teams can wait at that location to expedite refilling. The Agris T50 and T25 use centrifugal sprinklers. In their default configuration, they have a dual layer structure, including an inner and an outer disc. You can see here how it works. The inner disc throws the liquid outwards, which collides with the outer disc. This collision makes the liquid into fine, uniform droplets. The droplet size can be adjusted by changing the disc rotation speed. With centrifugal sprinklers, you can use the remote control to easily adjust droplet size between 50 to 500 micrometers. There's no need to switch out sprinkler heads to change droplet sizes. A finer droplet size is ideal for fruit tree spraying to ensure better penetration and coverage. For tasks with a high drift risk, like herbicide spraying, a coarser droplet size is more suitable. When spraying sticky or viscous liquids like oil, you can replace the double layer disc with a single layer one to increase the spraying effectiveness. A new solenoid valve controls the start and stop of spraying, effectively eliminating unwanted drips. By default, the Agris T50 and T25 each have two centrifugal sprinklers. You can add two more sprinklers for a total of four for a max flow rate of 24 liters per minute, which improves the efficiency of orchard spraying. By adding two more centrifugal sprinklers, you can also unlock additional features. In manual flight, especially in complex environments, turning can be difficult. However, with four sprinklers installed, the drone can spray both forward and backward. The rear sprinklers work when the drone flies forward and the front ones operate when flying backwards. This eliminates the need for turning around during manual flight, simplifying operation. Another key component for the spraying system are the magnetic drive impeller pumps. Each pump contains two parts. The part that comes in contact with the liquid is driven magnetically, so there's no direct contact with the motor. This design protects it from corrosive liquids, like pesticides, thereby extending the pump's lifespan. You can see here how it works. It's very easy to disassemble and clean, lowering the maintenance cost. The magnetic drive impeller pumps enable a maximum flow rate of 24 liters per minute in the four sprinkler configuration. This is especially helpful for applications that require a high flow rate, like orchard spraying. The magnetic drive impeller pumps, together with the centrifugal sprinklers, enable the spraying of powder suspension solutions. For example, lime and sulfur suspension solution can be sprayed without any clogging issues. We hope this introduction to the Agris T50 and T25 spraying system has been helpful. If you want more videos like this, make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching.